Welcome back to my Keep Up channel. Trump hurls worst insults yet at Biden and Kamala yet as he claims ailing president, 81 has already secretly quit and names his replacement. As Democrats panic over what to do with Joe Biden, Donald Trump was captured on video giving his honest, unsparing thoughts suggesting his presidential rival has already quit in secret. In a video recorded while Trump was on the golf course, he offered a blunt assessment of his rival and his potential replacement on the ticket while talking to his fellow golfers. He referred to Biden, 81, as an old, broken-down pile of crap who was about to be quitting the race in a brutal, occasionally expletive-laden rant in response to onlookers who praised his debate performance. He just quit, you know, he's quitting the race, Trump says, sitting in a golf cart. I got him out of that and that means we have Kamala. Trump then turned his ire toward Vice President Harris, whom he may be relishing facing even more than Biden. I think she's gonna be better. She's so bad. She's so pathetic, she's just so f asterisk 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 ing bad, he said. Biden has been called upon by multiple elected Democrats and even some big-time donors to drop out of the race, presumably placing Harris at the top of the ticket as a replacement. The president is set for his first major interview on Friday with ABC's George Stephanopoulos, in a chat that was originally set to air Sunday morning but will now air at 8 p.m. Friday night. On Wednesday, six Democrat state governors met with Biden at the White House to share their concerns about the octogenarian's performance, but insisted afterwards that Biden has their backing. Trump proclaimed how happy he was with his performance at the Atlanta showdown. How did I do with the debate the other night? I kicked that old, broken-down pile of crap. He's quitting the race. I got him out the race, and that means we have Kamala. He scoffed at the idea of Joe Biden, following the debate, showing up to talk tough with America's enemies. Can you imagine him with dealing with Putin and the president of China, who's a fierce person? He's a fierce man. Very tough guy. When asked about the video by the Daily Beast, Trump advisors pivoted to talking about the dishonesty of Biden's party. Every Democrat who was calling on crooked Joe Biden to quit was once a supporter of Biden and his failed policies that lead to extreme inflation, an open border, and chaos at home and abroad, reads the statement from Chris Lachivita and Susie Wiles. Make no mistake that Democrats, the mainstream media, and the swamp colluded to hide the truth from the American public Joe Biden is weak, failed, dishonest, and not fit for the White House, they added. They then offered a new, cheeky nickname, for the vice president. Every one of them has lied about Joe Biden's cognitive state and supported his disastrous policies over the past four years, especially cackling co-pilot Kamala Harris. They finish by stating that Trump will beat any Democrat he faces off against in the November election. His comments come as a more sitting Democrats have called on President Joe Biden to withdraw from the presidential race, striking another blow to the campaign as defectors trickle out against him. Arizona Democrat Roel Grijalva, 76, is urging Biden not to run again, the New York Times reported Wednesday. He is the second sitting Democrat to call for the president's withdrawal. Two other House Democrats have openly said they believe former President Donald Trump will beat Biden and that lack of confidence will surely be a topic of conversation between the party leaders which is planned for this evening. If he's the candidate, I'm going to support him, but I think that this is an opportunity to look elsewhere, Grijalva said. What he needs to do is shoulder the responsibility for keeping that seat, and part of that responsibility is to get out of this race. Source, DailyMail.co.uk Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.